Hey, what's up, gamers? Welcome back to another video. It's me again, Bullets Lord Tala. Yes, I did just finish recording last video. I have nothing else to do. So, yeah. Anyways, today I figured today as I was running on the treadmill at my gym, I was thinking about what my top five favorite ice cream flavors were. Actually, no, I wasn't. I was thinking about something else, but I remember a while ago I was thinking about what my top five favorite ice cream flavors were. Top five, because, like, the number five specifically, um, because, um, I've, fun fact, I think that I've only had ice cream five times this year. First time was when my best friend Azaria randomly bought me an ice cream at school. She said that I kind of needed it, and I haven't had one of those in years, like in months. I meant, well, actually no, the ta the ca like she bought me a mint chocolate. Um, well, actually no, she bought she bought three ice creams: a chocolate trumpet, another chocolate trumpet, and a mint chocolate. I mean, a mint tr trumpet, and she said I could have my pick, and she would have one of the chocolate ones, and so I chose the mint one because yeah. She did it. She's so nice. Um, and I told her that I, because like I, I used to have trumpets a lot as a kid, but then I stopped because they changed the packaging and that made me feel sad. But she bought me one so that I could reminisce about my childhood. Thank you so much, Azaria. That's literally so kind of you. Her. Um, and that was the first time this year, a few months ago. And then... I had an ambrosia ice cream from that gas station, and then the next week I had um, another, I had a cookies and cream sundae from that same gas station. My mom told me that I needed it. <laughs> um, and then, uh, a few weeks ago we went to, we actually did go to Burger King. I got a hamburger, and I got... The, what, a King Fusion bubblegum marshmallow sundae because a few months ago we went to Burger King and they, and we saw that on the menu. I didn't get it because that's when I was like super, 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 super strict about my calories and I did not get that. And then I got sad, I, I felt sad and I kept thinking about it for months and I got it last, uh, like last week and it was tasty, I guess. Um... And the fifth time I had ice cream this year, um, I, uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure it was last week as well. My mom and I, we went to a cafe and I got an iced mochaccino, which is strange because usually I would get a long black because long black's my favorite, but now I decided to spice it up and get an iced mocha for a change. And the lady said, oh, do you want cream and ice cream in it? And I I wasn't thinking straight, so I said yes, and she gave it to me. It was actually quite tasty. And it was I think that was kind of good, because usually at the cafe, whenever you ask for an ice drink or whatever, it's like that much drink, that much ice. But with the one I got, it was just, uh, it was like entirely drink, no ice at all, because of the ice, you know, the ice cream. Um... Anyways, we both saw, yeah, that's right, my top five favorite ice cream flavors. Actually, no, I actually had an ice cream another time this year. Um, we went to a Pink concert. We, I, we remember when I saw Pink at the start of this year? Um, we were there, and my dad, he went to go off to get something. And he asked if I wanted anything, and I said, no, please don't get me anything. And then he came back with a Rocky Road ice cream for me. I felt sad about eating it because I read the nutrition facts on it, which was kind of hard because I was in the dark. And it said that it had like 400 calories or something, and that made me scared. But I still had it anyways because it would have been rude to not have it. Um. Anyways, yeah, that's why Rocky Road, it's, it was delicious though, so it's on my top five list. Another thing, Rocky I mean, what's that one? Goody gumdrops, goody goody gumdrops. I like that ice cream. I had it in... Oh yeah, that's right, 2019, it was the end of the school year. The teacher did, he brought in ice cream for us. And 
Goody Garden Drops was the only available flavour. So I just had that. That was nice. I enjoyed it. I haven't had it in a long time, but I'm pretty sure it was bubblegum flavoured. Um, and it has, like, jelly stuff in it or something. I don't really know. Um, Ambrosia ice cream. Remember when I said that I had the Ambrosia sundae? Well, yeah, it had, it had Ambrosia. I'm pretty sure it was Ambrosia ice cream. I'm not sure what exactly it was, but it was tasty, so that's, that's on my list. And this isn't in order, by the way. I, I, it's hard for me to order things. And I mean that ordering as in ranking things and ordering as in I can't order my own food out of a restaurant. My mom has to do it for me. Um, and it's not that I, I can't, it's just that I don't want to. I don't want to do that. Um... Well, and I still need to do choose two more, two more. Um, cookies and cream. It's it's fine. Not my favorite though. Um, if I mixed Monster Energy original no sugar Monster Energy with plain ice cream, which is not vanilla ice cream, is is there a different that there's surely there's a difference between vanilla ice cream and plain ice cream because vanilla ice cream it's vanilla flavored if you mix monster energy into that then it's going to taste like a weird fusion of monster and vanilla but like if it was like just plain ice cream wouldn't that be like snow or something like if i got snow actually no it doesn't snow in where i live i've never seen snow i've always wanted to see snow like, is, if that's, like, ice cream, then I can't, then can I, like, mix Monster Energy in with that? And then it would be Monster Energy ice cream? Because if so, then that would be my ultimate favourite ice cream. Um, I remember there was also this other really nice one that I had when I was a baby, I think. Or, like, a toddler. I was at my grandparents' house. They had this random tray of ice cream. And... Like, they had this random assortion, like, box thingy of ice cream. And, and it was, I'm not, I have no clue what it was. It was, like, vanilla, vanilla, like, plain white vanilla. But then it had, like, this weird orange gooey stuff in it. It was fruity. I'm not sure what it was. It was, like, vanilla, but then it had random chunks of the gooey golden stuff. I have no clue what it is. What is that? Um, but it was tasty and I loved, I loved it. Um, I really like anything bubblegum or marshmallow flavoured, so if that was an ice cream then yeah, sure. Um, I remember when I was a, a little kid, well actually no, I think it might have been a few years ago, maybe, I'm not a little kid, I was like an, like a, I, w I would have been about like eight or nine or something, I remember my favourite kind of ice cream. This is number five, by the way. Oh, like, number one. Um, this is on my list. But it was like this unicornito thing. It was a strawberry ice cream cone. And it had pink and blue ice cream. And it was like marshmallow and bubblegum flavored. And then it had... It was kind of like a trumpet. And then it had this, this gooey pink stuff in the middle. It tasted like strawberry paracetamol, which is delicious, and I love that. Not my favorite medicine, by the way. My favorite medicine is peach and vanilla flavored demison. It's like the best. I could chug like a bajillion bottles of it, I'm sure. But it's like twenty dollars for a bottle. That's expensive. Um, and it had some other stuff on it, and it was it was delicious. I I I haven't had one in years, but I want to have one of them eventually, sometime. I, don't know when I have not been able- I've been looking for them, but does anyone know we can get those unicornitos? Please tell me. Anyways, yeah, make sure to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you get all the latest updates. <sighs> I'm tired. I'm gonna go to sleep now. It's, it's only quarter past six now, whatever. I'm, I'll, I'll go to sleep. Bye!